It's Saturday. It's April 22nd, 2023. Um, they said this week, they said today on the news that today was Earth Day. I don't have the official date on that. But I just want to show in the area, there's these, this is the tree line. Um, and then the cars. This is what happens with the allergens. I mean, there's a layer of allergen and then you have I mean it's it's really thick it's very um, it's a high amount of particulate if I zoom out sorry it's like a microscope hold on I mean you can see the film I don't want to touch this guy's car, but I will to make the difference. I mean, there's the mark and the, the difference, and it's actually on my fingertip now in such a high quantity and amount. But it's not just this particular vehicle. It's several vehicles from where I'm walking, um, all different levels of the particulate. You can see... And what this is important or an like important conversation about is the amount of asthma and allergy at the moment. Um, it's been since I was little. Um, they replaced the um, it's they replaced the trees. I think uh, at one point there was a campaign something was introduced it was called an Asian beetle um, and then they came through and they replaced a whole lot of the trees I don't really know the specifics on it they said that there was a bug that was here and they wanted to replace trees um, I don't know if it was in honor or in vain or how they categorize themselves all I know is that we're left with this residue um, that currently there's food allergies and then there's the um, air pollutant allergies uh, going on and it's causing it's wreaking havoc honestly on like the IG um, I think it's IgG and IgA uh, that's like the immuno immunoglobulin I had to have myself tested for some um, more recent food allergies uh, a while back to see what was causing flare-ups um, of health, potential health problems um, for my own individual. Um, and so, but this is what they call seasonal allergies where the trees are now in bloom and while it looks absolutely beautiful, it's all over the cars. And you can see, it's not like a small, faint pollen. It's a large granular particulate. Um, and like, yes, like the last few days, I've been having swelling in my fingers. Um, so it's almost like a whole body response which I had to take a um, allergy tablet in order to reduce the swelling that I had going on. Um, it's a minor fix to a, to a larger problem. Grateful that I have access to that kind of uh, medication over the counter, but it doesn't help in the fact that um, it's just, it's almost like the um, the immune system is being overtaxed or the immune system is being attacked by things like however they're genetically modifying the food I mean they've taken the fruits and the vegetables they've taken all the flavor out of them it feels like um, I don't know who they would be but someone in this industrious revolution and whatever um, and during the time that I've been in New York, um, there's been decreasing health benefits. Um, 
and it's just one of the pathways of what's changed. Um, again, George Washington is still at the head of the quarter, which is the most important feature. I'm frightened because some of the tales have changed. Um, but again, if we're talking like emperor and flipping of a coin, that goes back to port or that goes back to pile um, or tail side. And then there's this book series that came out. Um, there was a movie that came out with Ed Harris in it, which I really, I mean, I'm really appreciative for his career portrayal of um, whatever he was tasked to do by whomever um, is working with a Nicolas Cage, knowing perhaps there's a William Cage in a different movie franchise. However that works, I don't really know. Um, but I'm really listening to how and what and then dissecting the words he used to construct myself a reality um, and knowing that there's family members from both sides uh, in colleagues um, so I'm, I'm keeping that in mind and then I'm grounding myself in what do I have going on in Nick's cage here since I've been alive which is prior to William's cage arriving um, and how it's changed and almost just documenting from my field point of view um, where some of my concerns are. I wrote this morning. Um, it's been now like my grand, my grandmother, my great grandmother, my grandmother, my mom and myself in this slide downwards um, in not being able to um, raise children and have that like the middle class is almost completely gone but yet George Washington is still on the head of the silver quarter or then whatever nickel plated quarter I don't know um, I think it's silver these are important factors as far as government goes um, different pieces of conversation. Um, so it's star 1978, star 8378, Nicole Ketter's Earth, Solar System, Milky Way Universe, Galaxies Broken. Um, I'm going to pause this for one second. There's some turtles.